More local news now. The last day before Thanksgiving break got wild at a local school, but it wasn't the kids. No, this young buck made his presence known. Oh, dear. <laughs> Am I right? Oh, dear. Very <laughs> news good. News 2's Nicole Smith takes us to a Robertson County classroom with the story of a little deer that did some learning the hard way. While many districts are already looking forward to Thanksgiving break, a Springfield school was dealing with a break of another sort, a break in. So, how's everybody else's morning going today? This guy's had a rough one. But it's not your usual culprit. Reading, writing, and arithmetic mixed in with a little nature this morning at Westside Elementary. TWRA officer Caleb Stratton getting the call. Everybody was a little surprised and excited to see it at the same time. The two and a half to three and a half year old uninjured white tail buck appeared to be part Houdini when Stratton first arrived. He didn't see any broken glass and all the doors to the classroom were closed. The deer actually ran through the glass, but the glass did not break. It busted the door frame, the window frame out. Uh, the window then turned probably 180 degrees and the deer was able to go through the window or to the side of it. And when the deer went in, it, the window closed behind the deer. Other than the driver drop off line having to be diverted, a couple of tables and some chairs turned over. And let's just say a hall pass not obtained to go to the restroom. It was a short school day for the buck. When he went out the door, he ran off just pretty as he came in. In Robertson County, Nikkel Smith, News 2.